God, he's, he looks old then. Or was it just me? He said he's thinking about the future. Oh. oh God, he's picturing her old too. Bye, Harrison. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what? When? This morning at 10 a.m. That was the Department of Corrections. Hector Estrada is up for parole, he thinks. There's a good chance he'll get it. Remember I told you about my mother and how she died? You know, he was the leader. He gave the order. Uh, what about the others? I killed one. The other one's dead. Dead? Strata is the last survivor. I'm sure you'll have something to say about that. <laughs> She's fine with it. <laughs> yeah. He drinks her coffee. She's perfect for him. No one but you would see it that way. Mm-hmm. Right? Maybe killing Estrada yeah. will close uh -huh. this chapter of my life. Mm -hmm. We find that the prisoner meets the requirements for parole under the Compassionate Release Statute. At this time, we invite any victims present to uh, enter a statement either for or against the board's decision. Yeah, he wants them out. Mm -hmm. Nadia, it's uh, me again. It's my fifth message. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Just want to know where you are. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Taking a survey. <laughs> The Christmas spirit around here sucks big ring your dicks. <laughs> yes, oh, She's living out in Hylia. Two drug arrests since Juvie has two kids from different fathers. Maybe we should let your brother know what we're doing. I mean, we're investigating his girlfriend. I already told Dexter that if I found anything on Hannah that I'd act on it. Okay? my friend. Oh, hand me one of those zip ties on the table there, will you? Oh boy. About to have the talk? Yep. Uh, fucking Christmas lights. <laughs> but they look so pretty after. Every year I put them up and every year I wonder why I bothered. <laughs> you said you wanted to see me. Yeah. Mm -hmm. He has no idea what this is about. I wanted to give you a heads up on this idea that Captain LaGuerta's got into her head. Oh shit. What? Oh, he's cracking her out. The Bay Harbor Butcher. Maria's convinced that Dokes was innocent. She thinks it might be you. You're gonna tell him? Wow. Me? Laugh. Personally, I think she's had one too many mosquitoes. Or whatever that's called in goddamn drink. But anyway, here we are. You're the jackass of the year. because What makes you think I'm the Bay, Bay Harbor Butcher? If she knows your life story, what you saw in that cargo container. Most people had to screw them up for life. It's weird, huh? You might be trying to feel them out. Yeah. Another thing that's weird, that cabin where Dokes died was rented to a man named Jimenez. He's one of the men who killed your mother. I mean, cool. what are the odds? That doesn't look good. He's interrogating me. Yeah, he is. I always had a bad feeling about Dokes. He obviously didn't like me too much from the get-go. Mm. Mm. Something happened that I've never told anyone about. Oh, boy. Well, I saw Dokes on his boat. Dokes had a boat? Yeah. I figured he used it to dispose of his victims. So now it makes sense that he made his boat. Right. Dexter, you slick son yeah, of a bitch. I'll talk to Maria. I can't believe you believe Get her to move on. What makes him think no he is different than his brother? And the fact that he mentioned the boat, how he moved it. I'm giving them a boat to search for. Right. Just kind of like... like to make sure there's something for them to find. He's so slick. Hey, don't splash your sister! So she knew Hannah. At least they can't take your kids away for tobacco. He was a counselor at a halfway house where you resided about ten years ago. Someone spiked his coffee with rat poison. I don't have any idea what you're talking about. I want to know exactly what happened. And in return, I'll promise you immunity from prosecution. I will keep you out of jail, and I'll make sure that your kids have their mother to put presents under the tree. Like, fuck that bitch. I give my kids for that bitch. <laughs> you remember the first and last time Dad took us to see Santa? You yanked his beard and I asked for a gun. 
What is it? You sure you want to know? Right. The bird is still looking into the Bay Harbor Butcher. Shit. They think it's me. You weren't gonna fucking tell me? Do they have anything? I don't know. Mm -hmm. I need to put them off this once and for all. How? Give them definitive proof that Dokes was the butcher. Oh boy. Careful with it. Fuck it, it's too risky for you all, do it. Yeah, no. I'm not gonna let Harrison grow up without a father, and I don't want to argue about it. I just want this to be the end, once and for all. Deb! Hey, guys. Oh my God, what, what won't she do for Dexter? <laughs> Dexter looks stressed. I mean, Deb I'm sorry, stressed. but I just don't think Dexter Morgan has anything to do with the Bay Harbor Butcher. I've heard of people fucking their brains out, Maria, but God Almighty. Uh, that's low. Even for you, Tom. Look, let's just follow up on this boat. Look, if James had owned a boat, I would have known. We'll call it a wild guess. He probably would have tried to keep its existence a secret. She's gonna let go, even if he says that. I can't go to jail, Anna. It's my kids again, I can take it. I'm not gonna let that happen. When that fucking counselor was putting his hands on us and I shut him down for good, he backed me up. Oh, it was perfect. Always stuck together. It's not going to change now, is it? But that detective's going to come back. I'm going to figure something out. You just have to stay strong, okay? Maddie's in Vegas. When? A couple days ago. She left you know. I probably shouldn't have rated. What did it say? Staying here was too hard for her. Hello? She'll never forget what he did for her. I'll be that. Oh, I'm too afraid to leave you alone. You might decide I'm the Bay Harbor Butcher and hold me in. <laughs> <laughs> what is Shut it? Shut the hell up. Take a look. It's a deep sea fishing lures. Meaning they're the kind you need a boat to use. Oh, that's the ever wait, no. Wait, that's where Dexter wants to go. Did he plant something there? I think he's tricking them. Yeah. To make them think it is Dokes once and for all. We don't know Dokes used this place. You're jumping to conclusions. Don't talk about her boy. It's a dress. She can't say that. <laughs> Forensics team of yours. Yeah, what about him? Get him out here. The blood's too degraded to analyze, but we found one print on the hilt. It's a match for James Dokes. Well, that sews it up. This evidence could have been planted. Dexter is a forensics expert. Mm -hmm. And Maria, it's over. What is wrong with you? Maria, why can't you let this go? I guess because I feel I owe it to James to clear his name. Why? Because he was innocent. You're not an investigator, Maria. But either way, I'm done here. I expect you to live up to your end of the bargain. Don't worry, you'll get what's coming to you. So I expect to. She's screwing him over again. She might. <laughs> like, she might. I'm retired and still screwing her. Oh, what the hell are you doing here? Uh, I came here to talk to you about Dexter. If you care about him as much as I do, you'll listen to what I have to say. Just As much as you do. I care about him more, bitch. I'm all ears. I'm his sister. I think that Dexter could be a whole lot happier if he knew that you and I could find some common ground. I'm not gonna give up until you're murdering asses behind bars for good. That's how we're gonna work out our issues. Mm -hmm. But hey, thanks for stopping by. <laughs> Even more amazing is what we found hidden inside it.
leaves no doubt as to Dokes' guilt. Believe me. Well, <laughs> I gotta say that's uh, about the best Christmas <laughs> present so I could have imagined. You and me both. Have a good Christmas with your boy. Uh, just we will. My late lamented dark passenger would be very pleased if I could break this last strand from my past. Thanks, Jeff. What if Hannah tries to hurt Deb? Because she's not letting up. Steve Gaskell. <laughs> Come on, man, you're a legend. You're gonna be a state in my shoe if you don't crawl back to where you came from. I had this uh, contact in Honduras, an old army buddy, since we had crate of sativa every other month. I've been trying to lay it off where I can, but it keeps piling up. It's just too much for me to move. I'm not sure Enough to make you shit your pants. I can show you this stuff. Let me know if you're interested. Maybe we can work something out. First, let me hear you say you're not a cop. I'm not a cop, man. Jeez, we know a lot of the same people. <laughs> oh. Long time since I've dealt with those guys. Where or when? 35 Keyside Road, tonight, 10 o'clock, unless you have something long, else to do on Christmas Eve. Deb was at St. Joseph's in Hylia. She's been in a car accident. I'll meet you at the hospital. This she tried to bitch. kill her. This bitch. I knew it. I knew it. After that little talk? Yup. Her wrist is broken and there's lots of bruising, but she'll be out by tomorrow. What happened? And apparently she blacked out or something behind the wheel. Does Deborah have a prescription for anti-anxiety? Is she I mean, it's not that it's a problem. Most people do. Yeah, she does. Why? But the doctor said there was a lot of that in the system. Deborah drove out here for an interview, a second interview with a woman named Harleen Schramm. Now look, Dex, maybe I should have told you this before now. Deb got a tip that this woman, Harleen Schramm, was a possible witness to a murder. A murder committed by Hannah McKay. Yes, you should have told me. Deborah has a bug up her ass with this girl. Maybe that's why she took all those anti-anxiety pills. Because she's convinced that her brother is dating a killer. Mm -hmm. So you're killing Deb. Dump that bitch. Yeah, it's more important than that. I don't know what happened. I was tired. I was driving. She could have done that. Hanging by my seatbelt. And you were going to spend it with Arlene Schramm. Hannah told you. Hannah knew? She was at my house yesterday. Arlene must have called her after I left her house. Hannah was at your house yesterday. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. Hello, Dexter. It's like, <laughs> she didn't poison you. Well, I sure as shit didn't swallow a handful of pills. <laughs> I took one. One. Poison. Last night. Oh, shit. Wait, how was she up I handed it to her. That's a really good plan. She's good. It can't much. look like I accidentally took too much of a prescription that yeah, I have. Yeah, made it look like she It's not a hard drug to get. How would she even know that you were on it? That's the thing about people that poison people, Dexter. They're really fucking sneaky. Mm -hmm. So, she what, poisoned you while she was at your house last night? Yeah, how the fuck she did I went for a run. Maybe she broke in after I left or something. She broke into your house and did what? I don't know how she did it. Because she didn't. This is exactly what happened to Sal Price. Dexter, being blinded by the thought that. Open your eyes. She's stressed because of you. So you took one, then you lost track, you took another. And another, it's possible. Mm -hmm. She has her like crazy. Dex more right than she knows about what happened to Sal Price. But Hannah wouldn't do that to Deborah. How you know? Would she? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, question is so Stop being so what? Oh, I'm that over it. Hurt. I made my living at crime scenes. She was drinking a beer when she came. Mm -hmm. Why don't you mix the pills with something else? Something that's drowsy, makes you sleep. Yeah. And it looks like her pills. Like she wasn't paying attention. That's her pills. Yeah, this is hair. Blonde hair! Analyze it. Is this proof that Hannah was here? Oh, Test it. Test it. Come on. Did she break in? I think it's about proof that she broke in. She had a window. Or did this fall off me? Did I track this in just now? Yeah. Yo! She survived, man. She's 
she was supposed to die. She was lucky. Look at her head crushed. If that water is drugged. Put her in the water. If that water is drugged. I'll see what the lab has to say about what's in this bottle. It's residue right there. Yeah. What is that? We're having a Noche Buena at the restaurant later. <laughs> Howdy will be there. You should come back. Uh, thank you.